Hi there, and thanks for joining me as I talk about the proton pump inhibitors. Omeprazole and pantoprazole and other drugs that end in the P-R-A-Z or Z-O-L-E affects are proton pump inhibitors. Proton pump inhibitors are the most potent inhibitors of acid secretion in the gastrointestinal tract, and they reduce the acid secretion by up to 99%. Recall back in physiology, why do we have the acid in the first place? Well, the acid is necessary to break down certain nutrients, and it's necessary to uh, as a defense against microorganisms. And we'll get back to that when we start talking about the side effects, because obviously the side effects will be related to those changes that we're making. But with respect to the proton pump inhibitors, you might say, well, why do we need them? In certain conditions, such as the uh, peptic ulcers, uh, peptic ulcers is a break in the continuity of the uh, gastric lining, and with that break in the continuity, it's really, really difficult to actually repair that with acid that's just constantly bombarding the, uh, the ulcer. And in cases where there's a chronic a gastroesophageal reflux disease, there's going to be acid that splashes up into the esophagus. And that, after a long period of time, 10, 20, or 30 years, uh, that actually has the possibility of resulting in or contributing to the development of esophageal cancer. So there's situations in which we definitely need to decrease the acid. And as a matter of fact, the World Health Organization has recognized that and put the proton pump inhibitors as one of their most valuable medicines. If we go inside the stomach, the lining of the stomach has this type of appearance, and it's got that gastric pits, and within the gastric pits, there's, at the top there, there's uh, mucus secreting cells, and then as we get down into the pits themselves, there's other cells of other types, and the one that we're interested right now in is the uh, parietal cell. The parietal cell has a number of different responsibilities, like secreting intrinsic factor, but the, the main uh, reason that we're interested in the parietal cells with respect to the proton pump inhibitors is because the parietal cells secrete the protons, the hydrogen ions, the H+, plus, that actually is going to be secreted from the parietal cells. Now, if we take a look at that parietal cell a little bit closer and then even get closer in and go all the way to the cellular level where we've got the cellular membrane, on the cellular membrane of the parietal cells, there's thousands and thousands of these little um, proton pumps. Now, remember what the sodium potassium ATPase pump was. And here's an example of the sodium potassium ATPase pump. Well, the proton pumps are really, really similar, except that they secrete hydrogen instead of sodium. And those hydrogen ions will be secreted into the gastric pits, and then they'll combine with chloride ions, and that'll become hydrochloric acid. And that's why it's so acidic in the stomach. The proton pump inhibitors like omeprazole and pantoprazole and other drugs that end in the prazole aphex, those are going to irreversibly block the proton pumps. The other thing that we need to recall is I said, you know, the acid is really important. I said that that's important to break down nutrients and it's, it's important to, uh, for the absorption of nutrients. It's also important for uh, destruction of bacteria. And that is, uh, you know, when we, when we dramatically decrease 
the amount of acid in our system, in our, in our gut, there is going to be a decrease in certain nutrients like iron, uh, calcium, uh, magnesium, uh, like I said before, vitamin B12, and there's going to be a decrease in absorption of various drugs. Uh, drugs are generally made for an acidic environment. They're made to be changed or altered uh, in an acidic environment. And when it's going down into a neutral environment, that can dramatically affect the absorption of some drugs. And then finally, one of the other things that is a side effect of the proton pump inhibitors, because of that decrease in the acid, the dramatic decrease in acid, there is going to be an increase in a lot of infections as well. So infections in the gut and also, interestingly, infections in the lungs. As the person is on proton pump inhibitors like omeprazole and pantoprazole, and other prazole drugs, as they're on those drugs for an extended length of time, there is a greater incidence of cardiovascular, renal uh, disease, and also a greater incidence of dementia as well.